Welcome back to Afridia Anime Review episode number. Uh, let me take a look here. That's just episode number 18, excuse me. This I'm reviewing the pretty much kind of in a way the newest episode of the series. It's episode 13. Even though it's first one released in three months. Yeah. It's considered to be the 13th episode of the season, so kind of in a way episode 26. Yes. The 26th episode of the series is called known as From a Detour to World's Strongest. This snaps three short stories. Three. Excuse me. This snaps from the what, uh, the fourth bonus story from book four, the fourth bonus story from book five, and a short story from the manga. Yep. That's simple what this snaps. I'm like, Really? You have this for the OVA? I mean, I know they did this also pre season as well, where they have an OVA down for the entire short story. Uh, a couple of OVAs at first season. Now, I have heard there's another one coming up this summer. I uh, do not know when, but this is I, I did not know this one was coming out. Now, yes, it has been a total of about three months. Is it three months? Uh, this actually came out, like, I didn't know it came out because I had chicken inflammation for a while. Uh, this was released on at least 10 days ago. Really? Yeah, really. And the last one I did was like about a couple weeks ago. Yes. Now, for the three segments, the first one is simply you being asked to teach Mew, Corey, and that more, Mew, it's Mew, Shia. Well, basically, just have them writing in the Humvee for a while. And have to stop because Corey wants to help some people out, like uh, heals because she's a healer. Okay, fine. Then we have she asking you to teach them how to use magic. And they're not getting it. basically just her teach she she as her to you teach herself, Tio and Miu magic. They're not getting it, they can even drive a scientific expedition, they're really not getting it at all. And then Corey steps in and she's able to get no problem at all, and power gets really stronger. And then of course moving on to the very next town, which is and and after that they go to a town where they go to a a dress shop where like oh buy one of these dresses and well I'll be one of your favorites. Okay. Then we have one of the most unusual things, and yes, this actually happened from book five, mind you, yes. Where Mew comes to the interesting idea for one day, let's everybody swap clothes. Yes, so Mew puts on Yu's clothes. You puts on believe it or not, Tio's outfit. Yes, Teal puts on Mew's dress, though it's bigger than what she was wearing. Corey is wearing Shia's outfit, though she's out last, but before her is, is Shia, where she's wearing Corey's outfit. It was a very interesting idea to do this. I thought, like in the case of when Yu was wearing Teal's outfit, because the way Yu Yui uh, way Toa wears it, she basically, let's say, has a way to hold it up. You ain't not really know. Uh, it should be like one false step. The outfit could easily fall off. It should be completely naked. Well, look how basically she keep all well, basically the top part falls off. Yeah, <clears throat> so they say they make some adjustments to it anyway. So, and then moving on from that, this is actually from a short story from the manga, where you have Yue still wanting to have well trying to get Miu to call her mama, and of course she has her inner voice. That's very cutesy, and of course Miu treats her like a like a child. Despite the fact that Yue is over 300 years old and Miu is like six, seven years old. She's, she's just so adorable. This little girl. Yes. Mm Let's see, Mew is four years old. Yep, four. Mm -hmm. Yep, four years old. Mm 
Yeah, just a great little girl she is. And the kind of thing kind of ends basically with, with Hydra basically wrong. Of course, he's kind of embarrassing his lover, just being treated like a child. Yeah, kind of a weird ending to this OVA. I mean, yeah, this is the first, well, it's the newest episode. I didn't know this thing was coming out because I assumed episode 12 was going to be the finale. But nope, I guess we had this one, just, just a bonus episode. Uh, even if they don't say the place of this one, I would probably say this takes place between, and this is my personal theory. They probably had this one, and this is, my, my theory is that this one is set, I would say somewhat during the early episodes, probably before one of the mazes, they don't really say, but it's an okay episode. It's not really harmful, it's easily like, if you want to watch it, go right ahead, if it's not all that important to the series. I mainly watch it because I like the series. I like to complete this. But yeah, I didn't know this episode was coming out. I just know something about it. It's like, oh, we have a new episode. Okay, I thought this was OVA. Nope, not the OVA. This is just the uh, newest episode of the season. Just a bonus episode. So it looks like season two had 13 episodes, not freaking 12, as I thought it I thought it would. Yep, but not much to say about it. Okay, so that's it. So good. Next one is going to be One Piece. Okay, next video. Bye.